Yes, there was a discussion the internal combustion for generating or converting the revolution motion into the radiative motion. It consists of four cycles. First one is suction, second one is compression, third one is ignition, and fourth one is exertion. In suction stage, the piston consists of no fuels and both the inlet and outlet walls are open. When injecting the fuel, the piston may move changes from top base center to bottom base center and fuel is injected into the cylinder. In the compression stage, due to the compression of the engine by using a air fuel mixture, it moves from bottom base center to top base center. Later, the ignition takes place by using a spark plate and it leads to heat. The heat generated is due to the form of combustion. The piston tends to move from top base center to bottom base center and the smoke is liberated and there might be rotating of piston from top base center to bottom base center completes one form of revolution. This is the main principle and basic principle which is using in SI engines and CA engines based upon the construction, based upon the strokes. In two stroke engines, we use the suction and compression cycles in one cycle and in four stroke engines, certain cycle takes one complete of revolution and 720 degrees with a crank shaft rotating by using all these four cycles. These are the four strike engines and two strike engines based upon we classified next so on. Those are the advantages and disadvantages of two stroke engine and four stroke engine. In the advantages of two stroke engine is the ignition is very quick and very much faster when compared to four stroke engine. We can get a self start really fast when compared to four stroke engine. But the disadvantage is it liberates high fear of core. It, it is harmful for the solid engineers. That's why two stroke engines are being using the user. That's why updating those kind of uh, drawbacks, four stroke engines are being developed. Based upon the fuel injections, we you can use petrol engines and diesel engines, and the SI and CA engines are also being classified. Based upon cycle, we name them as SI like suction, compression, ignition, and exertion. Those are the cycles we have named so far. Next, going to the side, those are the disadvantages. Like due to the emission of uh, harmful gases, we reduce the use of two stroke engines. Next. This is the overall output of comparison between the two-stroke engine and four-stroke engine as shown on the screen. Next please. Suction and compression, those are the stages. And these are the diagrams due to the expansion of four-stroke engine. We have compression expansion. And these are the stages which are being discussed in exhaustion. And coming back to the topic, the main usage of internal combustion engines is for the movement of the revolutionary motion into the rotatory motion and converting the heat energy into the mechanical energy. And coming to the conclusion of the topic, machines are forever, machines are eternal. While we are using the decreased users, the machines will lend us to move into the rotatory of motion. So, machines will never and machines will be alive forever. Thanks for giving this great opportunity. Any queries? Okay, first of all, thank you for your interest because of both are from one of the guy from Dublin and the other from CSC. Thank you. Sir. So I think you have a lot of interest on mechanical engineering. Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> so okay, uh, I'm asking small question oh. regarding to exchanges. Yes, yeah, sir. So I think so you have a bike. Yes, yeah, sir. So, yeah. Yeah, sir. so we will pour the petrol into the diesel engine. Yeah, what uh, what uh, what is the results? Um, the when compared to the compression ratio of is it run the engine? No sir, the engine will not run. And maybe oscillations may take place because of when compared to the petrol engine, diesel engines have less compression ratio. That's why it get less kind of mileage when compared to petrol engines. And oscillations may occur. And the spark ignition why we are using petrol means it has more liberated towards the spokes. And uh, when we ignite the system, when compared to diesel engines, it needs carburetor. It means the mustard shape because of air fuel mixture. When it consists of air fuel mixture, then the petrol engines may work. If we don't have to use the carburetor, we can develop the BS6 model. But when compared to BS4, BS6 produces this kind of mileage. For mileage purpose, we use the carburetor, sir. For using our carburetor instead of BS6, we use the air fuel mixture. Like it mixes the air quantity and fuel quantity by using a carburetor. Okay, very good. Uh, another more question is, uh, yes. which engine will produce just more mileage, uh, uh, petrol engines or diesel engines? Sir, when compared to petrol engines, diesel engines will provide more mileage, sir. More In power, yes, sir. Because why I am saying like this is, 
it does not consist of any SINS and this kind of smoke may generate it. and compression ratio is very high when compared to petroleum Okay, what about load carrying capacity? Uh, load carrying capacity is nearly 4 to 5 percent based upon the petrol tank we are using so far. Okay, okay. Okay, very good. Any queries? Is there any queries? Is there any? Your name is? Mainly D. Haji Hussain, sir. Okay. D. Haji Hussain. Haji Hussain, yes. Yeah. yes sir. Uh, Mr. Hussain? Yes, sir. Uh, I have a simple question for you. Sure, sir. Yeah. Ask me. Can we use both the fuel injector and the spark plug in the same SI engine? It is not possible, sir. Why I am saying like that means when we are using a petrol engine, while using any kind of diesel in it is not perfect because those quantities may not prefer for SINS when compared to compression ratio. We prefer those kind of ignition system based on the compression ratio. That's why we prefer certain limits based on the requirements and based on the car. When we are using, nowadays we are using a hybrid engine, sir. Both water and uh, petrol might be used, eh? but they need, they need certain kind of equipment is required. For petrol, certain kind of equipment is required, and for water, certain kind of equipment is required. We cannot run both water and petrol at a time. That's why it, cannot, it is not possible to run the SINS and CINS at a time. Thank you. Thank you, sir.